Hey guys, Rex Hart here with another Awakened Chaos Error video. As you may be aware, the toll bar has recently gone under a change here. So as you guys might be aware, we they changed the ability Fissure. Grants one Tolpic Fever stacked when under 50% health at the start of each round. If this character has four stacks of Tolpa Tefera at the start of the round launches a bonus attack with Fissure, dealing true damage to all enemies. So basically they've made this champ this one a mini a mini dragon. So if you are having trouble beating this stage I would not worry too much about it um, I am aware that they do currently have a mission here in the um, advancements for new characters or new players that you are unable to do as the only stages that have shields now are health stages um, unfortunately But it's actually I've I've heard from a lot of people that this is actually harder than what it used to be now that they removed the shield because if you don't kill the boss within four turns after dropping him below fifty percent health, you will be wiped. You will kill your entire team. Now you can still do this if you have a Mathesia. You can basically manual it and then put the Mercy Shield on Mythesia, she can revive your entire team, and that may or may not help you beat this. Um, another way for some people is to attack the right, then left minion, and then build Mercy Shields up on everyone. So if you are having trouble with it, that is one way to counteract the, um, the death, basically. I have not witnessed the... Um, the full damage myself so what we might do is because I'm curious we'll put the we'll make sure you focus my Thesia here give her the mercy shield I want to see this fever go off so I'm aware that I'm doing a multi battle that is completely fine so what you could do is just attack the right minion and then the left Hopefully we can do it without doing too much damage <laughs> and killing them. They might be a bit too strong, but we'll see. Four stacks coming up. I'm going to see how strong this actually hits us for. I'm guessing, I'm not too sure if it will wipe us through the Mercy Shield. So it's the whole point of checking it out. So we have until... I guess next round bonus attack so now if we don't kill it we should be okay uh, we should have saved that spell all right here we go true damage it did 63,000 interesting so we were able to survive with the Mercy Shield. So having people on possibly a revival set could probably help you survive this if you're struggling. That was interesting. Um, yeah, very good. We were able to do it because Garrel's OP, low-key. The counter-attacks that he does and the damage output that he can do. Very good. We actually surprisingly won, even though we purposely took the, the entire blast there. Very interesting. Um, unfortunately, they didn't change um, one of the missions. Um, so in here, I can't remember. Is it Master of the Heroes? No, it's not that one. It's the Conquer of the Dungeons. So if I recall... Defeat. Uh, which one was it? There's a, there's a mission 
to get through the shield here. There we go. Defeat the boss shield in one turn. Now, that is a big threshold for a lot of players. A lot of you guys won't be able to do this anymore because they didn't think ahead. So unless they change that this week in an upcoming patch, which I hope they do, the only way you're able to do this is in Hell Stages. So let's hope they um, fix that up. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Take care. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.